I need you to sign. This downtown driver was issued a citation today. DMV investigators say they caught him using a disabled placard belonging to someone else. You're not admitting to guilt by signing this. I just saw that you will show up on the court yes. date at this address below. A disabled placard gives drivers with a legitimate medical condition the right to park downtown for free. But some people abuse them. That's why you'll see them offered for sale on eBay, which is illegal because the placards are not transferable, whether it's from a grandparent or a coworker. So at the same time he's saying he's using a coworker's placard. Uh, when we approached him on it, he didn't have the ability to, to answer for it. Bottom line, he doesn't have authorization to use that placard. Exactly right. And he was issued a citation for a misdemeanor. DMV stings like this one are designed to crack down on drivers who use other people's placards. I don't feel that's good. That's why I tell my kids, no, you can't use my car. Don't park. Don't get me in trouble. You'll get a ticket because that's not what it's for. The placards are meant to free up parking spaces for people like Margaret Johnson, an advocate for disability rights. I think it's critical that we continue to make sure that um, placards are available for people with disabilities so that they can get out there and participate in a society just like everyone else. Parking in downtown Sacramento can be a challenge. The city of Sacramento has found that it's almost an epidemic problem. A big problem because the city has only 5,300 parking spaces downtown in a county with 117,000 disabled parking placards. We do issue about 91 citations a year, misdemeanor citations, if they are found to be bogus, if they are using someone else's placard, for example. Now, all the drivers who were cited today had their placards confiscated, and they will, of course, get their very own day in court. Reporting live in downtown Sacramento, Mike Lurie, KCRA 3 News. Let's talk about those fines for using someone else's placard. What could that set you back? Well, Gulston, they're not cheap. They can range anywhere from $400 to $1,000, depending on what city you get caught in. That is some big money. All right, Mike, thanks. <laughs>